Hippopotamus. The hippopotamus, hippopotamus amphibious, also called the hippo, common hippopotamus or river hippopotamus, is a large, mostly herbivorous, semi-aquatic mammal and ungulate native to sub-Saharan Africa. It is one of only two extant species in the family Hippopotamidae, the other being the pygmy hippopotamus, Chiropsis liberiensis or Hexaprotodon liberiensis. The name comes from the ancient Greek for river horse. After the elephant and rhinoceros, both of which are found in Africa and Asia, the hippopotamus is the third largest type of land mammal and the heaviest extant artiodactyl in the traditional, non-cladistic sense of the term, not including cetaceans. Despite their physical resemblance to pigs and other terrestrial even-toed ungulates, the closest living relatives of the hippopotamidae are cetaceans, whales, dolphins, porpoises, etc., from which they diverged about 55 million years ago. Hippos are recognizable by their barrel-shaped torsos, wide-opening mouths revealing large canine tusks, nearly hairless bodies, columnar legs and large size. Adults average 1,500 kg for males and 1,300 kg for females. Despite its stocky shape and short legs, it is capable of running 30 km per hour over short distances. Hippos inhabit rivers, lakes, and mangrove swamps, where territorial males preside over a stretch of river and groups of 5 to 30 females and young hippos. During the day, they remain cool by staying in the water or mud. Reproduction and childbirth both occur in water. They emerge at dusk to graze on grasses. While hippos rest near each other in the water, grazing is a solitary activity and hippos are not territorial on land. The hippo is among the most dangerous animals in the world due to its highly aggressive and unpredictable nature. They are threatened by habitat loss and poaching for their meat and ivory canine teeth. Physical Attributes Hippos are among the largest living land mammals, being only smaller than elephants and some rhinoceroses. Among the extant African megafauna, behind the two African elephant species, they average smaller than the white rhinoceros but are larger by body mass than the black rhinoceros and the giraffe. Hippos measure 2.90 to 5.05 meters long, including a tail of about 35 to 56 centimeters in length and 1.30 to 1.65 meters tall at the shoulder. Mean adult weight is around 1,500 kg and 1,300 kg for males and females respectively. Very large males can reach 2,000 kg and exceptional males weighing 2,660 kg, 3,200 kg and 4,500 kg in captivity have been reported. Male hippos appear to continue growing throughout their lives while females reach maximum weight at around age 25. Hippos have barrel-shaped bodies with short legs and long muzzles. Their skeletal structures are gravipodal, adapted to carrying their enormous weight, and their specific gravity allows them to sink and move along the bottom of a river. Hippopotamuses have small legs relative to other megafauna because the water in which they live reduces the weight burden. Though they are bulky animals, hippos can gallop at 30 km per hour on land but normally trot. They are incapable of jumping but do climb up steep banks. Despite being semi-aquatic and having webbed feet, an adult hippo is not a particularly good swimmer nor can it float. It is rarely found in deep water, when it is, the animal moves by porpoise-like leaps from the bottom. The eyes, ears, and nostrils of hippos are placed high on the roof of their skulls. This allows these organs to remain above the surface while the rest of the body submerges. The hippo's jaw is powered by a large masseter and a well-developed digastric, the latter loops up behind the former to the hyoid. The jaw hinge is located far back enough to allow the animal to open its mouth at almost 180 degrees. A moderate folding of the orbicularis oris muscle allows the hippo to achieve such a gape without tearing any tissue. The bite force of an adult female hippo has been measured as 8.1 kN 1, lbf. Hippo teeth sharpen themselves as they grind together. The lower canines and lower incisors are enlarged, especially in males, and grow continuously. The incisors can reach 40 cm, while the canines reach up to 50 cm. The canines and incisors are used for combat and play no role in feeding. Hippos rely on their broad horny lips to grasp and pull grasses which are then ground by the molars. The hippo is considered to be a pseudoruminant, it has a complex three-chambered stomach but does not chew cud. Unlike most other semi-aquatic animals, hippos have very little hair. The skin is 6 cm thick, providing it great protection against conspecifics and predators. 
By contrast, its subcutaneous fat layer is thin. The animal's upper parts are purplish gray to blue black, while the under parts and areas around the eyes and ears can be brownish pink. Their skin secretes a natural sunscreen substance which is red colored. The secretion is sometimes referred to as blood sweat, but is neither blood nor sweat. This secretion is initially colorless and turns red-orange within minutes, eventually becoming brown. Two distinct pigments have been identified in the secretions, one red hypocidoric acid and one orange norhypocidoric acid. The two pigments are highly acidic compounds. They inhibit the growth of disease-causing bacteria, and their light absorption peaks in the ultraviolet range, creating a sunscreen effect. All hippos, even those with different diets, secrete the pigments, so it does not appear that food is the source of the pigments. Instead, the animals may synthesize the pigments from precursors such as the amino acid tyrosine. Nevertheless, this natural sunscreen cannot prevent the animal's skin from cracking if it stays out of water too long. The secretion does help regulate the body temperature of the hippo and acts as an antibiotic. A hippo's lifespan is typically 40 to 50 years. Donna the hippo was one of the oldest living hippos in captivity. She lived at the Mesca Park Zoo in Evansville, Indiana, in the U.S. until her death in 2012 at the age of 61. The oldest hippo recorded was called Bertha. She had lived in the Manila Zoo in the Philippines since it first opened in 1959. When she died in 2017, her age was estimated to be 65. Behavior and life history. Hippos differ from all other large land mammals, being of semi-aquatic habits, and spending their days in lakes and rivers. They can be found in both savanna and forest areas. Proper habitat requires enough water to submerge in and grass nearby. Larger densities of the animals inhabit quiet waters with mostly firm, smooth sloping beaches. Male hippos may be found in very small numbers in rapid waters in rocky gorges. Hippos mostly live in freshwater habitats, however populations in West Africa mostly inhabit estuarine waters and may even be found at sea. With the exception of eating, most of a hippo's life occurs in the water. Hippos leave the water at dusk and travel inland, sometimes up to 15 kilometers, to graze on short grasses, their main source of food. They spend four to five hours grazing and can consume 68 kilograms of grass each night. Hippos coexist with a variety of large predators. Nile crocodiles, lions and spotted hyenas are known to prey on young hippos. However, due to their aggression and size, adult hippos are not usually preyed upon by other animals. Cases where large lion prides have successfully preyed on adult hippos have been reported, however, this predation is generally rare. Lions occasionally prey on adults at Gorongosa National Park and calves are sometimes taken at Virunga. Crocodiles are frequent targets of hippo aggression, probably because they often inhabit the same riparian habitats. Crocodiles may be either aggressively displaced or killed by hippos. In turn, beyond cases of killing the seldom unguarded hippo calf, very large Nile crocodiles have been verified to occasionally prey on half-grown hippos and anecdotally perhaps adult female hippos. Aggregations of crocodiles have also been seen to dispatch still living male hippos that have been previously injured in mating battles with other males. Thanks for watching.